I got something over here. Not something anybody wants to hear. However, it's these soldiers and airmen's job to find it. So, to decontaminate any outbreak faster, Air Force Hazmat and Army Chemical, Biological, Radiological, Nuclear and Explosive troops are training together to create a more flexible response team. It's trying to be uniform when it comes to response is the main thing. That way, when you're out there and responding, you're not all over the place or trying to figure things out. Some of those things were the differences in equipment, which were the base of the training. This one is level C, actually. And what you guys are, you guys are the equivalent of level D, okay? Level the service D members will take these lessons to their units, so when the time comes, they'll all be ready to work together. With this knowledge, now I know and have different elements to contact, go, as, go ahead and start training, I guess, my soldiers to react to different situations pertaining to Seaburn. As a joint base, it's important for Lewis McCord service members to work together, not only to respond on the battlefield, but at home as well, since both would respond to any outbreak locally. For the First Corps Field Report, I'm Sergeant Mitch Turnay.